Hello, Rob here from the Flanagan Homestead. Uh, many of you have come to me for advice on killing box elder bugs because they're a real problem in this neighborhood and I've been having a decent amount of success taking care of them myself with a backpack sprayer, uh, blower and insect ape. I tried a new product and I'm standing out here on the side of my house on a sunny day this time of year. Normally this is just covered with uh, box elder bugs, but I tried this new product that I found on Amazon that I'm gonna show you here in a second and you're going to see there's no box elder bugs on the side of my house right now. But if you go down the siding and then look on the deck, here they are, all dead. Just piles and piles of dead box elder bugs. So uh, the Insect Aid is a little bit less expensive and covers more ground that I picked up in Sagawa's. But this product that I did pick up on Amazon that uh, actually reads on the label as Box Elder Killer, which a lot of products don't read as Box Elder Killer, it does a great job. The one thing that I did not like about it is it says it's odorless. That's, uh, that's not true. Uh, there is an odor, but it, it, it's not terrible and it did dissipate after a couple of days of being on the wall. But uh, I think that this is the most effective product that I've ever used to kill Box Elder Bugs. And as you look at the product, uh, you can see that it has an applicator, that uh, actual spray nozzle that you can put on there for those of you that don't have a backpack blower like I have. In just a second here, I'll post a link to a video I have of the tools I use to apply this product and the products I've used in the past. So anyway, I know these box elder bugs drive people crazy, so here's a chance to knock them down. Thanks for joining me on the Flanagan Homestead, where Christmas trees are my business, teaching and cleaning horticulture is my job, and outdoor projects are my passion. Hope to see you again soon. Be blessed, everyone.